So after reviewing hundreds of backpacks on this channel, I picked out my 10 favorite options that you can use for a personal item on your travels. And the best part about this video is that each one of these bags that we're gonna talk about has their own in-depth, independent review, which you can find linked in the description below. And a special thanks to Unbound Merino for partnering us for this video. More information on them in a minute. All right, first on the list is this guy right here, the Able Carry 13 Day Bag. Able Care is a Hong Kong brand known for making bags that are really quite beautiful, but also very functional and weather resistant as well. The Able Carry Max is one of my personal favorite one bag travel packs, but the 13 makes a pretty freaking awesome personal item. The capacity is 13 liters. It weighs 1.5 pounds. It currently comes in four color options. It can fit up to a 14 inch laptop and it costs around 150 USD for the ripstop version or 180 USD for the X-Pack version but it does come with a lifetime warranty against manufacturing defects. Some of the top reasons why it's a great personal item. The X-Pack material in particular is extremely weather resistant. So if you're traveling, you get caught in some rain or some snow, your gear will be protected. You got a quick front access compartment right here, which makes it super easy to grab your gear while you're wearing the bag, like flying through the airport. This hidden pocket on the shoulder strap could be a great spot to sort of like fold up your boarding pass or keep like an MTR card. And this hidden back pocket here is the perfect spot for your passport. To find out if the Able Carry 13 Day Bag is the right personal item for you, be sure to check out our full review linked in the description below. All right, next up on the list is this guy right here, the Simple Commuter Backpack. Simple is a US-based carry brand who's known for making gear that's like the intersection of I like to work hard, but I also like to play hard and hit the waves at like, you know, 5 p.m. during sunset. That's what this bag is. It has 20 liter capacity, weighs 2.5 pounds, only comes in one color option, black, has a side tech compartment that can fit up to a 16 inch laptop, and it comes in at a full retail price of around 220 USD. But again, that comes with a lifetime warranty. Now here's why it makes such a great personal item. This material is 420D Cordura Ballistic Nylon with a face, and a face just means like a coating for extreme weather resistance. So yet again, you're traveling, you get caught in the rain, this thing's gonna protect your gear as good as any bag as I've ever seen. Clamshell style opening is awesome for travel. It just makes it easier to pack and find your stuff. You got a quick access horizontal pocket right here. But what I love for a personal item is when it's underneath the seat in front of you, you got this half moon tech compartment, which just makes it super easy to grab what you need, when you need it, when you're on your flight. And it also has a luggage pass-through holder, which means it's great to pair with a suitcase. We did a full review on the Simple Commuter Backpack, which you can find linked in the description below. You know, Margaret, I'm glad we're doing this roundup. I've been wanting to do it for a long time. You gotta have the right personal item when you're traveling. But you know what else you need when you're traveling? The right clothing. No, but serious, like travel clothing is like this really hard thing. And I travel to like 15 countries a year and I could never really find like the right clothing to wear that's functional and efficient, but also looks freaking good. And that's why I'm so stoked about Unbound Merino, which I'm literally wearing right now, sweater and pants. See, what's so cool about Merino wool is that it actually wicks moisture away from your body and it acts as a safeguard against odor causing bacteria which means it's just really breathable and like it just, it just keeps you feeling fresh, you know? Not all merino wool is made equal and Unbound just does it so well. This is literally my favorite hoodie I've ever had in my entire life. And the travel pants, they just look good and it's something that I can confidently wear like in a business meeting. And just as importantly, it's got the right look. I do a lot of business overseas so when I rock my merino pants for my flight, I know I can just show up at a business meeting right after that and then go out to like a dinner, all while feeling super comfortable. And isn't that like the best of both worlds? Looking good and feeling good and not smelling bad? It's like the trifecta right there. We only partner with brands that we truly believe in here in Nomads Nation, and I'm genuinely obsessed with Unbound Merino. And to learn more about them and their awesome travel clothes, be sure to check out the pinned comment in this video. Back to the review. All right, next up on the list is possibly my favorite personal item of all time, the Air Tech Sling 3. Air comes from San Francisco, and they're known for making dark, urban, and mysterious, and highly functional travel gear. And this one's a really innovative bag. As to wear, it's like a sling you can wear in the back, but also go into brief mode, but also go into messenger mode, but also clip off shoulder strap and just go into like handheld brief mode. It's a lot of carrying versatility. It's got nine liters of space, so it is definitely on the smaller side. It's super light, only weighs 1.3 pounds. It comes in one color option, black, it can fit up to a 14 inch laptop and the price runs around 120 USD, but that does come with a lifetime warranty. Here's why it's one of my favorite personal items. Like I said, it can be worn in so many different ways, right? So if my shoulder gets a little tired or my hand gets a little tired, or you can just like mix and match, which is fun. But also like, I just don't need a lot of stuff on a flight. And I like to get work done on my flight because I'm a psychopath. So, so I'll just carry the bare essentials, laptop, headphones, charging cables, 
and it's just a lot less that I have to deal with like putting under the seat and then I got more leg room. So that internal organization is great for all your tech stuff. And the strap is cool because no matter if you're left or right handed, you can kind of switch the orientation. And if you don't want that dangle, you know, this getting caught on the ground when it's underneath the seat in front of you, you can take the strap off, put it inside, dangle, be gone. To learn more about why the AirTech Sling 3 is one of my favorite personal items and maybe bags in general of all time, review, link, Description below. Next up on the list, we have the Bellroy Venture Travel Pack 26 liter. Bellroy comes from Australia and they're known for making beautiful bags. Like there's a lot of other selling points for Bellroy bags, but their aesthetic is one of the biggest selling points. Which makes sense because I think sometimes when you, you know, you're waltzing through the airport, maybe you're single, ready to mingle, you know, you want to look like good while you're doing it. While also still having some nice capacity and functionality. It has 26 liters capacity. It weighs 2.4 pounds. It's currently only offered in black. The tech compartment is big enough for a 16 inch laptop. And the price is 350 USD with a three year warranty. So I think it's a good personal item because A, it's super weather resistant, right? So again, it caught in some bad weather. This primary fabric and the PU coated zippers got your back. Also again, when it's underneath the seat in front of you, we've got this quick access top pocket, right? Easier to grab maybe the few things that you leave in there, AirPods, small notebook and some pens. That quick access goes a long way. Also, it has an internal water bottle holder. That helps kind of cut the bulk down, right? So if you're on a more of a budget flight where there's not a lot of room to put your bag underneath, this kind of keeps it nice and slim and flush. And it's got a great luggage pass-through holder that allows you to keep the bag standing upright. So if you're pairing this with a suitcase, this is always better than this. Is this the personal item of your dreams? You should watch our full review to find out. Links below. Next up, we have the Alpaca Bravo Toe Pack. Another brand from Australia and a bit newer on the scene. They've been wreaking some havoc in the world of carry. And I think that this is a awesome personal item. Some quick specs. It's got 13 liters capacity, weighs 2.2 pounds, comes in three color options. The tech compartment can fit up to a 16 inch MacBook Pro and it runs around 140 USD. Again, with a lifetime warranty. I like it for a personal item for a bunch of reasons. One of which yet again is a quick access pocket. That's really accessible when it's underneath the seat in front of you, right? And this is a deeper one. Some of the other quick access pockets were like to here, but this one's like to here. So you can fit more stuff in there, easier to access. You also gotta love the fact that you can stow away the shoulder straps. So when you're not wearing it in backpack mode, you wanna put it underneath the seat in front of you, just pop these into place, much cleaner that way. And again, luggage pass-through holder that allows you to carry the bag vertically. And it's a, it's a nice little guy, like this paired with a suitcase, I feel would work very well. To learn more about the Alpaca Bravo Tote Pack, link, description, down there. Next up, we got the Modern Day Fairer Backpack V2. Modern Day Fairer comes from Deutschland. And true to form for all things German is you got that like real like eye for detail, high performance German engineering going on here. The capacity is 24 liters. It weighs 2.4 pounds. It currently only comes in black. The separate tech compartment can fit up to a 16 inch MacBook Pro. And it runs around 185 USD with a one year warranty. I think it's a great personal item because yet again, it's got a really cool look to it, which is assisted by this beautiful fabric, which is an 840D ballistic nylon made from Cordura. We got a luggage pass through holder, but it does require you to put the bag sideways. I love this bag for quick access. So if you are wearing it in the airport and you wanna throw your passport, boarding pass or whatever in these pockets, you can quickly access them. And you got a really nifty hidden back pocket here, which is great for your wallet and or passport. And if you're a business traveler or you just want fast access to your laptop, this tech compartment is isolated, which gives your laptop extra protection. And it also makes it easier to access. To learn more about the modern day fair backpack V2, you know what to do. Next up on the list, we have the Pack Small Expandable Series 2. Pack comes from the US and they're known for making really functional bags that typically have pretty epic expansion, which is absolutely the biggest selling point of this bag because it can go from 17 liters to 27 liters, which is really great for a personal item because it gives you versatility, especially if you're at the airport and you're like in 17 liter mode and you want to grab a couple extra things from the gift shop and duty free, unzip it, expand it, you're, you know, and you're rocking and rolling. The weight is two pounds, six ounces. It comes in four color options. The laptop compartment can hold up to a 16 inch MacBook Pro and it runs around 225 US dollars. And that comes with a 30 day satisfaction guarantee. And here's why this could satisfy you as a personal item on your travels. We do have a luggage pass through holder. Got to carry the bag on the side, but at least it's there. The ability to stow away the shoulder straps, yet again, a cleaner personal item experience. You've also got an internal water bottle holder accessible from the outside. But really, I think the unique selling point is that expansion. It could even be a great one bag travel pack. Like if you just want to fly with a personal item on those budget airlines in Europe and in Asia, 27 liters, pack all your stuff. And then when you get to your Airbnb or your hotel, unpack, compress, and now you get your 17 liter day pack for all your travel adventures. Full review, link below. All right, next up, we have the Carhartt Classic Laptop Backpack, which is not the 
best personal item in the world, but also it's the most budget friendly on our list. And it's kind of a friendly reminder that like, at the end of the day, you don't necessarily need to spend two, 300 bucks in a backpack as a personal item. This guy will absolutely get the job done. Not as efficiently, but let's look at the job done. It weighs 1.3 pounds, has 25 liters capacity, comes in a bunch of different color options depending on if you're buying it from Amazon or from the Carhartt store. It can fit up to a 15 inch laptop. And for all that, it only runs around 50 USD. I think it makes her a good personal item for a few reasons. You got this like half moon shaped pocket right there. Yet again, easy access when it's underneath the seat in front of you. These things are durable, man. Like I, I, the stitching, the construction, like it's definitely not gonna fall apart on you when you're at the airport because nothing will be worse than that. And maybe even most important of all is it's got a really understated aesthetic. So if you're traveling to a country where theft could be a bit more of a problem, a bag like this is significantly less likely to draw unwanted attention. Carhartt makes really high quality bags and to learn more about this one, down there. All right, next up we got this guy right here, which is the Nomadic Travel Pack. And Nomadic's a cool brand because like in the carry community, people like me, bag nerds. Nomadic was like really innovative and they're kind of like the forefathers of this because they started bringing really high quality and expensive bags and making them a bit more mainstream. Some of this bag's top features are its expansion capabilities. It can go from 20 to 30 liters. It weighs a hefty 4.1 pounds. Comes in three color options. It's got a clamshell opening tech compartment that can fit up to a 16 inch laptop and it currently runs around 300 USD but that does come with a lifetime warranty. I think it's a good personal item for a lot of reasons. One, it's definitely like a very businessy looking bag, right? So if you're on a business trip and you wanna pair it with a suitcase, you can slide the trolley handle right through there. Shoulder straps stow away. Quick access front compartment. You got the clamshell opening, which is great for travel. And yeah, this is just a backpack that says, I'm flying for business to go talk at a conference about how we crushed Q4 earning projections. And if that sounds like the personal item that you're looking for, full review down there. And last, but certainly not least, is the PAX Everyday Backpack 22 liter. It's a US company based in Montana. PAX makes beautiful gear. That's also very functional. I think this is a good personal item for a few reasons. Some of the specs real fast though. We got 22 liters capacity, a weight of 2.2 pounds. Comes in four color options. We got a separate laptop compartment that can hold a 16 inch MacBook Pro. And it runs to 50 USD, but that comes with a lifetime warranty against manufacturing defects. Here's why I think it's a pretty cool personal item. As I was saying with the Carhartt, it kind of gives you a very subdued aesthetic. It's not gonna draw a lot of attention to it. But let's say you got a bit of a budget and you want something that's nicer with nicer materials, then you can kind of splurge on this bag. As you got a lot of functional stuff such as a very nice light colored internal lining, which gives it a highlight effect that makes you feel like it's well lit. Lovely internal materials. And again, a nice little half moon quick access pocket. So when it's underneath the seat in front of you, easy to obtain. And it can also pair with your luggage very well. Pop it on the suitcase sideways. I've got some thoughts on this backpack, pros, cons, everything in between. And to learn what those are, link description full review. Before we wrap up, it's tea time. And a quick few notes about like what makes a good personal item for me and like what you should be looking at as you determine what makes a good personal item for you. You may have noticed some recurring themes throughout this video where I was talking about quick access, both when you're wearing the bag and when it's underneath the seat in front of you. So that's really important. Shoulder straps being able to sew away, not being too heavy and lightweight, I think is also very important, especially as airlines are getting stricter in terms of their weight restrictions, especially in Europe and Asia. I live in Hong Kong and they're literally like weighing your personal item before like every flight, even on the premium airlines. It sucks. And another thing to consider is like what you like to have on you during your flight. Are you the kind of person who travels like a bunch of snacks and drinks, an extra hoodie in case you get cold, your own travel blanket, right? That's gonna require a larger personal item. Are you looking to get work done on your flight? If so, you know, a great personal item with a decent suspended bottom for your laptop compartment can go a long way. Also, like how much leg space do you want? I'm 5'8", so I'm a smaller dude, so I don't need as much leg space, but if you're, if you're like a taller dude or dudette, and like your legs are like, you know, really taking up that real estate. If you got a big backpack under there, that's gonna cause knee problems. And ain't no one want that. It's a lot of things to take into consideration. But if you're still here and you're not quite sure which personal item to check out next, I recommend giving this guy a look, the simple commuter backpack. It kind of ticks a lot of the boxes for a personal item. I'm really impressed with this quick access and weather resistance. And to learn more about it, simply watch this video right here. A special thanks to Unbound Marino again for partnering with us on this video. And to learn more about them, be sure to check the pinned comment below. If you got any questions, holler at me in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Aaron, this is Nomads Nation, and we'll catch you next time.